Welcome guys, more advanced warfare information. Today we're going to be talking about all of the camos within multiplayer and how to unlock them and what the top camo in the game is going to be and what it's going to look like. This is going to be a long, long process if you guys are looking to get the top camo, but it's going to be called Royalty and it is essentially based around literally like sort of like a king's garment. It's got diamonds in there, it's yellow, it's bright, it looks pretty crazy. Uh, we're going to be going through all the camos and letting you guys know how you can unlock them in preparation for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. It's literally just a few days away, guys. It's absolutely insane. Hope you're keeping up to date with all the latest information. There'll be more videos this weekend. It's crazy, crazy stuff and super exciting. So. Uh, unfortunately, I can't show you guys the royalty camo within this video. But I'm going to try and bring up an image that sort of best represents it. Um, essentially, if you remember the video I did talking about diamond camo coming back. Diamond camo is coming back, but it isn't the highest. Royalty is. But you can see here some of the garments being worn by the character. And this is essentially royalty on uh, someone's sort of body in terms of the exosuit. But it looks a little bit different on the camos. And I'll try and bring up an image later on to talk about that. So let's start off with the camos that are available within Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. To start off with, you've got multicam. You need to get 50 long shot metal medals with this weapon. You then got multicam black. You need to get 100 long shot medals. Urban, 200 long shot medals. Strand, 300 long shot medals. Woodland, 500 long shot medals. So a lot of medals there. Now, this actually changes depending on which category you're in. For the um, assault rifles, it is long shots. For SMGs, it is hip fire kills. For shotguns, it's hip fire kills. And for snipers and heavy weapons, it's long shots. So you have to be grinding out 500 of those. Uh, once you've done that, you can also do. Uh, cryptic Raid Camo. This you need to get 50 headshots with. Digital Classic, 100 headshots. Cryptic, 200 headshots. Cryptic Yeti, 300 headshots. And then Digital Urban, 500 headshots. Holy cow! 500 headshots with this weapon to complete that camo unlock. That's crazy. We then got Concrete, which is 50 strafe medals. Now this changes a little bit depending on which category you're in. Uh, you then got Urban Jet, which is 50 triple kill medals you then got cryptic neptune which is 50 kills shortly after dodging which is one of the new movement abilities carbon fiber which is 50 kills with no perks attached and then gold to get gold you need to get 50 kills with no attachments now as far as where you do not need to do these um unlocks in any order so you can actually get gold easier than you can get the 500 headshot um uh, unlock which is very weird not too sure why that's been done but hey you can get gold in your camera fairly easily now to get diamond on your camo, you need to complete all of these challenges for that weapon and that will get diamond on that gun, which will look very, very cool. Now, royalty. How do you get royalty? Well, it's unlocked in the same way that you can unlock diamond in Black Ops 2, which is by completing all of the camo challenges for every single gun in a category. So that means you need to get 500 headshots with every single gun in a category and then complete all the other challenges on top of that to get royalty on your gun. Which is going to be a lot of effort, not going to be easy. If any of you guys manage to do that over the next year on Advanced Warfare, then shout out to you guys. That's an impressive feat. But let's take a look at what royalty is going to look like on your gun. It's essentially sort of like a very patented yellow gold design. It's going to have diamonds thrown in there, uh, nice and bright colors. It's all like red and blue, sort of like crystals as well. So I'm sorry I can't show you guys the exact image, but once the game comes out on Sunday, then I can for the moment. Just imagine it, you guys will know that it looks absolutely crazy because we've seen it, of course, on the characters as well. But there we go, guys. That's a look at all of the cameras that will be available within Advanced Warfare and how to unlock them and how much of a grind it's going to be to get that royalty camo on your weapon. If you've enjoyed, give it a thumbs up. It's going to be another video out later today and lots of videos this weekend. And then, boom, Monday, loads of videos for Advanced Warfare. So hopefully you guys are keeping up to date with everything. Check out more videos on screen here in case you've missed them, including the second part of me having some crazy experiences with the Navy. So cheers for watching. I'll see you guys later today on another video.